New details tonight in the controversy surrounding New Jersey Governor Chris Christie. The mayor of Hoboken, New Jersey, has made some new claims against a pair of top Christie lieutenants. Mayor Don Zimmer says Governor Christie's camp pressured her into a redevelopment plan in exchange for Hurricane Sandy relief funds. Scott Thompson has the story. Hey, Damning new allegations about New Jersey Governor Chris Christie. You have, a, uh, you know, the Christie administration using their authority to try and get something. Don Zimmer, the Democrat mayor of Hoboken, New Jersey, says the governor's office threatened to keep Superstorm Sandy relief money from her town if she didn't support a redevelopment project by the Rockefeller Group, a real estate firm with close ties to the Christie administration. Lieutenant governor pulled me aside and she said, the Rock, you know, essentially, you got to move forward with the Rockefeller project and that this was a direct message from the governor. Christie's camp pushed back hard against the claim and in a statement said, it's very clear partisan politics are at play here as Democrat mayors with a political axe to grind come out of the woodwork and try to get their faces on television. Zimmer's allegations do come at an interesting time. She said the threats were made back in May and since then she has publicly supported Christie. So why didn't she say anything at the time? I didn't think anyone would believe me. I, I really didn't. I mean, I, I do, looking back, you know, I probably should have come forward. These latest allegations add to Chris Christie's problems. He's still trying to dig himself out of the Bridgegate scandal, which some say was an act of political retribution against another New Jersey mayor. Scott Thompson, KHOU 11 News.